I missed this round last year, to, uh, the alligator. Um, I was kind of busted up, so I've always looked forward to the alligator. I've, I've won here a couple times, and it just, uh, to me, it suits my style. I don't know. I just, I just have a really good time here, and, and uh, you know, just I, I enjoy the terrain. It's, it's a little pretty difficult to ride. It's, you know, it's, it's pretty, pretty hardcore stuff. So I enjoy it, and um, yeah, things went well. I was pumped for the, you know, to turn things around and, and uh, to get a win. First three tests, we were kind of in the hunt with, with some times. I was ahead of them, so I felt pretty confident. And in the, uh, the fourth test, I think it was, um, it was like a 10 miler, and uh, I think he had some problems and issues and stuff, and I. I had a really good test and good time first hard, first part of the track and then uh, or the first part of the test and I end up catching up to him by I think at the end of the the fourth test. So I, it's it seemed to work good for me. I was I was pumped on doing that. I made up a full 50, you know, 60 seconds, a full minute. So I knew things were there good from there on. I just wanted to keep my head on straight and just kind of uh, uh, just you know just take it in from there and not push the envelope too much. The last couple tests, I feel really good. I think the first couple of rounds haven't been going that well. You know, obviously the first round didn't go good for me. So um, you know, I feel good physically. Everything else has gone good there, but uh, I just had some issues with my bike and uh, you know things have got turned around and we're making you know making some headway now. So so I'm, I'm happy about that. You confident for the season? Yeah, you know what? It's it's uh, it's early. I usually like I don't get started until warmed up to like March or April. So it's about time I'm starting to feel things again and, and things are coming back. We didn't have much of a break, and I think I tried to to try too many things and got the bike turned around and just didn't have a good off season and actually tried you know a lot of different things than I ever would have. So I, I should have took some more time off and just kind of uh, got rested up. But we rode quite a bit and got a. Uh, you know, got herself kind of started from behind a little bit. So I'm, I'm, I'm amped for the rest of the season. I think things will, you know, will definitely, uh, you know, the, where we're going, Louisiana, Tennessee. You know, I like those places. The places, uh, the races out west. I'm looking forward to those too. So, you know, we just keep our head on straight and, and uh, you know, just keep, you know, nipping away at it. Everybody says, how's it going? You know, how's it, you know, how to think the scoring's happening and all that. I mean, just look at the numbers. You know, it's, I, I think it's the best off-road, you know, race uh, series we have. Thanks, man. Off-road series. We we have so uh, you know in the states I think it's it's um, you know it's, it's evident by the by the 600 riders are getting it you know by the you know all the way up till the third round now yeah I, you know what it's it's I think my buddy who said it best the other day what by uh, my, my buddy Robbie said I, I was you know it's not it's not eight time or this and that I think I was stuck on eight so if I'm stuck on eight for the rest of my life I don't care you know uh, you know looking at records I never thought about it when I was you know and I never heard about it when I was did four or five or six and now all of a sudden it's a big thing you know and it is cool it, it, it is you know you get a lot of people asking stuff about it and, and you know I definitely respect Dick for doing what he's done and you know especially with it with the uh, tools he had back then you know you know he didn't have a suspension guy he didn't have a motor guy he didn't have a mechanic you know he didn't have got you know giving them gear and helmets and this and that and you know Dick did it all on his own you know and I I think it's you know by far the, uh, a huge thing right there just doing it in his time of day is way harder than it is now I think but um, you know it's 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 still a cool thing and I you know I, I you know I appreciate Appreciate all the all the stuff and all the press about it and so forth, but um, you know, I'm, I'm if I'm done now, <coughs> excuse me, I'm happy. You know, I've, I've you know I've, I have nothing. Yeah, I have nothing to regret. Everything's been working really well. I'm just happy that I can be, you know, 33 and still racing and be in contention and win some races.